dumb but is here to entertain you. Being a traditional ruler has never been easy. Nobody will ever tell you that it is easy to handle the position of kingship. In our today's video, the war fluid between King Misuzulu and his entire family is definitely taking a different turn. It is going to higher heights as the court of law is being involved in this kingship matter already. I'm about to give you all some very shocking details because Mzansi reacts to Misuzulu Kazuletsini after he was spotted wearing something really strange, monumental and highly considerate and his brothers, his family as a whole don't want him to be king but unfortunately for them, he is the only person who is liable, able even by the ancestors and approved by the people to become the king of the Zulu kingdom. Watch this video right up to the end. Before I give you all the entire details, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel. Like this video. Drop a comment after watching the entire video. And hit on to my post notification bell. Considering the fights that have been going on with the king and his brothers, who also want a piece of the power, because they understand that great power and admiration comes with a lot of benefits. So, they also want to be kings. However, it is just so unfortunate that it is not going to happen because there can only be one king for a particular kingdom. After hours of rituals inside the sacred royal crowd, King Musuzulu Kazuletini has come out fully dressed as king. This is the same kind of ceremony that was done by his another brother, who is Prince Simakhade and he did try to coronate himself before the actual king. Now, officially according to the tradition, he is coronated, however, he is not the king. We saw that his coronation was like a sham, with only a few people attending the event and in comparison to the one which was done by Mrs. Zulu. You can as well see that there is a clear difference with his being more popular and having more people attend and celebrate his coronation. He also went to the jungle to secure a lion the way that it is supposed to be done. This is believed to be an oral tradition that is being practiced by the Zulus so you can understand it is a big deal. Simakade did not really do what he was supposed to do. However, Mr. Zulu is now fully on the throne and there is no one who can actually really change the situation. Now, we hope there won't be any more fights again. South Africans, especially the Zulu people, have been through a lot just within a very short notice and they want all of this to come to an end as soon as possible. Let all the hate, all the backlash, the cases that have even gone to the court of law, let them cease now. Even today, while people were actually making their way to the palace, the other faction of the family is believed to have tried to go to court to get some kind of an order to stop the proceedings because they felt like they were moving on with something that is very crucial. This is something which will determine that this, of course, he is the king and they weren't able to reverse it at all. So sad for them. Because of that, they have been dismissed by the court with the judge saying that it was not a present issue and of course there are more present issues in the court of law to handle. I personally feel so sad for what is going on in the Zulu kingdom but I pray and hope that all of this should come to an end as soon as possible. Jacob Zuma even came, sorry, Julius Malema even came at his defense. Julius Malema supported King Mrs. Zulu. Even Jacob Zuma's daughter came at King Mrs. Zulu's defense saying that he is the only person who is liable and eligible to be called the king of the Zulu kingdom and she received a lot of social media backlash because they said she is a snitch, she is a two-sided cutlass and of course she doesn't have stands because some time ago she is the same person who revealed that King Mrs. Zulu is not capable of running the clan and he is going to actually destroy the Zulu kingdom. He is going to walk hand in glove with politicians to destroy the people. You will tell me in the comment section what you feel about all what is ongoing. 